WTFNN. Headline News Update. Good afternoon, folks. I'm Steve Rhodes coming to you live from sunny Delray Beach, Florida. Thank goodness it's sunny. It was 58 degrees down here this morning. That is a bit too cold for Stevie. Right now it's 77. But if we take a look at what is hot, it is the markets. You've got the Dow up 331 points. That's about one and a quarter percent to the upside. S&P is up 30 points. That's 1%. NDX 1% and change. It's up 90 points. The Russell's up a little over 1%, up 18 points. The semi's up 27. What does it all mean though what does it mean jelly bean well if we take a look at the dow out here it's traded right up into resistance now i'm not saying this is a counter trend rally the move down that we saw on monday and tuesday out here but if it is this is where it would stop it's called Stevie's Green Line. It's basically at about 28,008. That is where price is trading right now. Now, if price can clear this area, well, then it suggests moving even higher. But right now, what we've seen with this nice move out here is price coming back to an area of resistance. Again, closing above resistance, well, that would be a beautiful thing for the bulls. But that is not the picture that we have. Let's go take a look at the NDX 100. What has it done? Because it is nice and strong. Well, Lo and behold, it has run right up into Stevie's green line. In fact, price is just a little bit below that level. Price is trading at 83.98 out there. Oh, my goodness, I wasn't even sharing. Here's the chart. Here is the uh, NDX 100 so that you can see it. Um, so that is traded up in resistance. How about that Russell 2000? I mentioned the Russell 2000. Nice and strong. Well, if we take a look at is it really strong? It's strong but maybe not really strong. It needs to pump a little more iron. Maybe needs to take a little iron. What does Stevie mean? Well, price is moving higher, doing less relative energy. That has created a little dark black line from lower left to upper right. And what that says, if we were to see some type of bearish reversal candle and then a close below Stevie's green line at 1624, well, that would be curtains. Curtains meaning taking price back to about the 1544 level. But price is above support. Price can move higher with less relative energy and can continue to do so. It only becomes a problem when we see the bears show up. And right now, we don't see any bears. Hey, if we go take a look at the New York Stock Exchange, guess what the New York Stock Exchange is doing? She's also moving higher, doing less relative energy out there. Hey, folks, that's how it made the bottom back in August. Will it make a top that way? Check in on Monday. We'll see what Sunday and Monday bring us. But stay tuned. Your favorite polar bear, David White's up next. Tom O'Brien to take you home from 3 to 5. This is Steve Rhodes. I'll be back with you on Monday at 1 o'clock. Thanks, folks.